A very good and windy afternoon Dutch bike blogger here. Thank you for riding with me. It's 5.30 on Saturday, 27th of March and I'm on my way from Appingedam to Groningen which is a well with these conditions a long bike tour especially because there is wind for Beaufort which makes it kind of hard to get from A to B when I went here see playlist in the description box from Groningen to Appeldaan on last Thursday the 25th of March I actually had wind in my back which is a lot nicer than having wind in the face so it will be a longer bike tour distance is the same but it just takes me more time to get there Whew. currently you're watching part one of a longer bike tour cut in parts probably four maybe five I don't know I will see and edit I've not decided yet a little out of balance well, let's go this way to the city center it actually pretty much has been raining all morning and afternoon with hints of sunshine it's now cloudy again by the way but it should stay dry according to according to the weather forecast it should stay dry And actually already can feel it's difficult to to move forward with well we have to do it we need to do it by the way local church Nikolai Kerk is in scaffolding looks like they are renovating it Let's get my bike into the Dijkstraat, which is supposed to be the local shopping area. But as you can see, not much is going on, and probably shops have closed at five, one more than a half hour ago. By the way, I'm wearing summer pants, a t-shirt and a jacket. No gloves, I have them with me, I have a hat with me in my back. Bike carrying, rack thingy, apparatus, bag. I'm actually loaded with stuff. Clothes, a laptop and whatnot. Bike repair kit and so on. thing I don't hope to use actually this is Koningstraat and I'm now past the yellow line and it's 
changes to bolwerk. Rotterdam is een older city, created or existing since I think 1200 or so. I'm not sure about the exact dates. Well, we are. Uh, Traveling under a cover of clouds. I'm planning on stopping multiple times. At one point, I do have to change or put on the external power bank. And I would be very lucky if I arrived at 7 at home. And that's the thing, I'm still in the area where there's houses. I'm going to have to move or ride over roads where no houses or very little houses out in the field I can hear a siren in the distance to my right ambulances Just do a short detour here, going over here. This is the old home for the where the military used to stay, the quarters. I think it was the medical staff. The army, the military is a long time ago gone away from Apigdam Phew! Oh, there's going to be a bike tour with a lot of resting and hopefully it will be flat a little bit more than this because this is up and down, up and down, which is not anything, something I really like actually. Junkers Lang just passed it to my right. I don't have a clue what this is called actually. Let's call it flat tarmac road for now. That's because it's very smooth. A little uphill. Phew. But it's surely difficult to get forward. Maybe change sides to my left. There is a dumpster deeper a channel, partly man-made, 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 partly already in existence. I think they widened it. Let's turn here over this bridge, Chamsweersterbrug. To the area known as Chamsweer. 2.2 meters high and then you're gonna hit the steel beam or 
the plate which covers the area that you cannot go there with a car higher than that. Let's turn around and do something different because I'm heading into the wind directly. Do not wish to do so, so let's go back over the bridge and ride on the other side. Seems to be a little better. More shielded for wind from the houses. Well, for the second time in a few seconds over this bridge going this way let's go here seems well a little better not super eleven minutes in and just left up in Gdom city or at least the built up area Phew. do have my bike light with me by me by the way so when it's getting dark or light is fading I'm able to put on a bike light to be visible that's the main purpose and I see by the flag which is <laughs> Not in one piece anymore, the edges are frailed. Well, this is the end of Apekadam, the city, and I can already feel some rain spatter again. Oh, jolly nice, not really. And actually really have to put on the push on the pedals to get forward. Ha! Huh. Gee. It's a bit of a bummer. What I'm going to do is cycle 40, 40, 15 minutes, stop, wear, rest and go again. Otherwise I will not get home. I cannot cycle one hour and twenty minutes with this with this wind. Way too hard. Okay, I can go fifteen to twenty kilometers an hour. I don't think I'm reaching 15 at the moment. Ha! Huh, crazy! Crazy, crazy.
let's stop at the next house there is a hopefully a driveway that you can safely park on and get a little bit stretching my legs because well let's go over the bridge and otherwise we will have to get moving again